In the neurological assessment of the child, don't neglect the general physical examination. Some of the parts of the general examination that are particularly important to note are the following. Somatic growth. Measure height and weight and compare percentiles with head circumference. Search for dysmorphic features. Carefully study the face, especially the mid-face. There is the old adage that the face reflects the brain because anomalies of the mid-face are often associated with underlying brain malformations. Eye examination. Children are often uncooperative, and it's hard to get a good look at the fundus, but patience and perseverance pays off. The retina is said to be the window of the brain, and the retinal examination can give valuable information for the neurological assessment. Skin search. A careful, complete skin search is important. Look for the stigmata of the neurocutaneous syndromes, such as cafe au lait or ash leaf lesions. Abdomen. Palpate for visceromegaly, which can indicate the presence of one of the storage diseases. Spine. Look for scoliosis in any sacral anomalies.